Now that I've gotten more into YouTube, watching more videos and supporting people I like and create, especially creating content myself, is I have more of a handle on YouTube and I understand how it works or how the el algorithm actually works as well. And one thing that I see quite a bit, and it's, you see it more with bigger YouTubers I think, is they're constantly asking their audience to comment on their videos for sometimes an, an irrelevant question. Like, they're only trying to get their viewers to comment on their video. The reason they're doing that is because comments are interactions with the videos. The more interactions you get with the video, the more likely the algorithm is to boost that video up. And so they're only trying to get those comments on the videos just to help boost their video a little bit more. To me, that feels a little disingenuous or dishonest, especially to your audience, just for the sake of getting more comments and boosting it with the algorithm. So I just want you guys to know that I will never ask you to comment on my video just to try to help boost it. The only time I'm gonna ask you guys a question or ask you to respond to one of my questions in the comment section is because I'm genuinely curious about something. Anyway, today, a little bit more busy day today. It feels like I'm more busy. It's not like I have that much to do. And what's crazy is that it feels like, oh, that is bright. I need to get an ND filter really bad. This looks awful. I'm gonna get in the shade. Oh, it's so much better. Anyway, it feels like I have more of a busy day today. I actually gotta get my kitten from the vet. He's at the vet right now. I gotta pick him up later today. It is just another absolutely beautiful day outside. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling. I gotta go work out. I'm gonna get into that because I got some stuff to do today. Bye. There, done with my workout. I can check that thing off the list. Hi, this is Alex Atlevig. I was just calling to check in on my kitten Talos. T-A-L-O-S. Okay, 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 awesome. So I can just pick them up anytime then? Awesome, that sounds great to me. Yeah, thank you very much, bye. Okay, he's okay. I gotta go pick him up pretty much anytime now, so. I feel bad, I feel, he's okay, but I, it, I just feel bad for the guy. He had to spend the night at the at the vet. He's gonna have to wait just like a little, a little bit longer because I got a few things that I need to get done. Kinda, I feel like I'm in a rush. I'm just going to apologize today and say if, if today's vlog is just a little bit more chatty, a little bit more talky than I like them to be. I'm going backpacking again with my buddy. Today, part of today's vlog is going to involve kind of preparations for backpacking. We're leaving tomorrow. Wednesday, we're leaving on Wednesday. Today's Tuesday, we're going backpacking for three days starting tomorrow and we have not planned anything. So, I need to plan that trip, prep all my backpack stuff, work out, pick up my kitten, mow the lawn, and film and then edit this video, which usually takes me a decent amount of time, so I just apologize if today's vlog is just a little bit more chatty than I would personally like. So, thank you guys for tolerating that. <laughs> Checkbook. Okay. Here we go. Got him back. What are you thinking, bud? <laughs> We're back, bud. Chicken. Hi. Hey chickens. Bye chickens. Okay. Oh, you ready, buddy? <gasps> Here you go. Welcome back. Oh, you're so happy. Kitten back in the house. I think that's probably the sixth time I've been back to the vet now. That's what you do when you have a pet, I guess, right? <laughs> the next thing I gotta do is go to the track and do a workout. We got one last thing and then I gotta edit this video. It's four o'clock right now and I need to edit this video still tonight. 
because tomorrow we're going backpack. Oh, that's what I gotta do, the backpacking supplies. Okay, like I said, I'm going backpacking in a few days, and so I gotta get all my gear out, get it all organized, and I'm gonna show you guys all of the stuff that I'm, or most of the stuff that I'm gonna bring with on this trip. All of my stuff is inside this big tote right here. Okay, first off, this is my backpack. It's a uh, Teton Sports. It's nothing, nothing crazy expensive. Scout 3400. It's a, I think a 55 liter backpack. Tent, really, really small bivy tent. Not anything for some long trips, like something that you just use for like overnight smaller kind of things. Cook stove, knife, sleeping bag, sleeping mat, dry bag, another dry bag, water filter. I had a Sawyer Squeeze. This is a Catadine Be Free. Um, basically the same thing. But I like it though. It works works great. It's awesome. Headlamp, toothbrush, and toothpaste. Rope, of course, you always need rope. Spoon and my mug. A compass and a trowel because, you know, bathroom. Check out this sick knife. Or maybe check out this one. Wham. Double sided? Oof. Sick. Or this knife right here. Bam. Homemade? This is a homemade knife from like my grandpa or my, my uncle or something. But then this is the actual knife I bring with for backpacking. It's more of like my hunting knife. It's good for backpacking, it's bigger. Yeah, it's a good one. Just Winchester, nothing crazy. That is most of the stuff I'm gonna bring backpacking. And it's definitely not like the best setup you can get. Backpacking gear gets really, really expensive and you can get some super lightweight stuff. I by no means have any of the best gear at all, but it does the trick for me and it works for my budget and who I am, so. I like it. It's awesome. It's a lot of fun, and I'm very excited to go backpacking. But I still got to do one more thing today, and that's go back to the track. I got to do one more workout. I know it's been a very long time since I've been to the track, but I'm getting back to that. I really wanted to say back on track with it, but I'm not going to do that. <laughs> getting back into doing more cardio stuff, I need to do that because it's very important, and it's good for you. So I will see you guys in, like, three seconds. And we're here. It's, like, 7.30, but... We're here. Time to do this workout. <laughs> 